Hey, what is up YouTube? It is Hamdog Hype and welcome back to my channel. So today I am very happy. I finally secured the Scarlet 151 uh, Elite Trainer Box. I bought this on Amazon for about 50 bucks, which I think was kind of a steal because I've seen these going up for a lot more. Um, I think the price kind of crashed recently once this finally came out. And I'm hoping it gets down to 40 bucks uh, per Elite Trainer Box because I want to open up a lot of these. I want those ultra rares and everything. But without further ado, let's go ahead and just check out what's in this. Let's open this up. Uh, let's go for it. Great artwork, has a promo card, which we're gonna probably sleeve, keep in the sleeve, and nine packs, 65 sleeves, which we are gonna use for our next few videos where we open Scarlet and Violet stuff, uh, 151 stuff. And then that's pretty much it. Um, basically, it's the same as every Elite Trainer box, just like a, it's like a kind of a special one, because it's uh, kind of has like, well, well, we'll go through the booklet really, really quickly to kind of show you what's in this set. It's some pretty fire stuff. I haven't seen too many openings because I like to keep myself surprised. But the stuff I've been seeing people open up is just absolutely ridiculous. And it just made me really, really want to get this box sooner than later. Um, wow, this feels like, this feels like old school, like paper. It's not even like the regular, like style they use. But yeah, these are all basically the poles. Um, these are not the most impressive, but then once you start getting to like the illustrator artwork section, that's where it starts to get a little ridiculous. Um, and then the, obviously the secret rare section, like you have Squirtle, my favorite starter with War Turtle. Now they include second, um, stages you got the blastoise ex we want that charizard and blastoise ex but hopefully that we have at least the blastoise um just awesome artwork from the original sets and then that mew gold is what we really really want oh that alexander looks really cool i didn't realize that was in here and look at that they have a black another blastoise ex oh wow okay so there's a lot of cards i didn't know that were in here that i'm just realizing now so i'm even more excited to open this up now so let's just kind of run right through this i'm just gonna throw out all the extra stuff here are the nine packs um Oh gosh. All right, here's the promo, which I'm gonna show you guys right now. That is a very, very cool promo. Kind of reminds me of Pokemon Sleep. That is almost perfectly centered. I may have to send this in for a grading. Holy crud, that's really well centered. All right, I'm gonna try not to damage that one. Um, here's the code card for you guys. There will be a link in the description below with code cards. Um, uh, sorry, oh, my Instagram, which I do post code cards here and there, and there should be a drop coming up soon. Has a bunch of the die, the counters, the sleeves. I'm sorry, not sleeves, the deck dividers, the energy, and then here are these sleeves. Very, very cool. We will use this in this video. So let me just put this to the side and then we can finally get started and open this. Sorry, as you can tell, I'm super excited to open this. I did not think I'd get my hands on this just because of all the uh, scalpers and everything going on right now. Apparently the scalpers are back. They took away the Pikachu with the felty hat. They basically bought them all out and are reselling it for like minimum of like 150 on eBay, which I think is ridiculous. Um, Shame on you, scalpers. <laughs> uh, anyways, let's start with our first pack, which is a Mew. I think they're all just Mew arts, actually. Yeah, they're all Mew arts. So let's start with this one. I just did a Yu-Gi-Oh video, so it just feels weird opening Pokemon cards. But this pack just felt nice to open up. Like the last box we opened up, the pack just felt super tight. I don't know if we're guaranteed a hollow or not. I'm gonna save half of the code cards for the gram, like I said. So if you want a shot at it, just follow me in the description below. And I think it's still just one card trick. Yeah, so there's an energy right here. Perfect. So we have energy, Weedle, a Zubat, Goldeen. That's a really cool art. They finally made Goldeen looks somewhat cool. Uh, we have a Cloyster, uh, Giovanni's Charisma. And then I think we still get three reverses. Uh, so that's one, two. And then the third is our rare. Uh, so awesome, good stuff. Uh, so it looks like it is a hollow. So I think we are guaranteed a hollow in all these, but. I don't know for sure. Oh, sorry, I'm getting a few messages. Uh, there we go. So let's go ahead and open up our second pack. Hopefully, so sometimes when I get messages, it stops the video prematurely and I don't like that. But I think we're okay. I think my phone's just being weird. All right, so we'll show you guys this code card. That's for you guys. Try to keep a balance of keeping half for the video and half for the Instagram, but sometimes I don't do too well with that. Anyways, we have an energy. An Abra, very cool art. Maybe there's a Kadabra art. I didn't see that just yet, but Bulbasaur, very cool. Venomoth, Rapidash. Or I think this is not This is not a reverse. This is our first reverse, which is a Grabber. Then we have a Tentacruel. And then we got a Nidoking Hollow. Very cool. Wait, why is Nidoking a dark type? That doesn't seem right. Wait, did they change Poison Typing? Huh. Interesting. Did they... Wait, I have to check this out now. They may have changed the poison typing. Yeah, so the only psychic types are... Oh, and there's a Kadabra art, so we can potentially pull a Kadabra. 
And I just saw Need Arena. Need Arena is a dark type. Wait, so they just changed it. Yep. Atkins dark type. Oh, and it's, it's an order of actual Pokedex numbers. So that's pretty cool. Wow, that's interesting. They they changed the... Wait, are there 151 cards in this set? Like in the main set? Oh my god, every card is available. Oh my god, I'm having an epiphany here. Okay, wow, okay, enough, enough. Let's let's move on. We've only opened up two packs. Holy crap, okay. I'm gonna save the hollows and sleeve them up a little bit later. I'm gonna save the sleeves right now for the main pulls, but whoa, hold on. So what I'm getting at is there's 151 cards in the main set, one for each mon in the Pokedex, and then there's just extra cards after that, like trainer cards and then like the secret rares, illustrator rares, whatever, what, whatnot. Wow, wait, wow, okay, I need to uh, I need to think about actually completing Master Sound this because that makes me very, very excited. We'll save that code card. Um, so, interesting. All right, um, Energy, Ghastly. So Ghastly is a ghost, so I guess ghost is still considered psychic energy, and then I guess poison is now considered uh, like dark energy or whatever. Interesting, all right. I have to look into that because I don't know if 100% if that's true, but that seems like what it is. Yeah, because Nidorino is also a dark type, a nice, a sand shoe reverse. We got a Venonat, and then we got a Vileplume Hollow. Very cool, yeah. So it looks like we are guaranteed a Hollow. I mean, usually three packs, and if you got a Hollow in every pack, usually means that there's gonna be a Hollow in the rest of the packs. Um, so I can stop saying that now. All right, this is the fourth pack, I believe. We still have not pulled an Ultra Rare, unfortunately. Hopefully we can pull at least one Ultra Rare Illustrator Art. Hopefully it being the Squirtle, but you never know. Sometimes you can go a box of pulling two or three, and sometimes you can go like three boxes without pulling one. So just the way it is. Oh, we got a hollow energy. So we'll save that to also get sleeved up after the video. We have a slowpoke, a very cool art. Growlithe, Geodude, Jigglypuff. So Jigglypuff is now normal. Is Jigglypuff a fairy? I don't know if Jigglypuff is a fairy or a normal. I think it's a normal, actually. Uh, Persian, this is our reverse. Then we have a Rapidash Reverse, very cool. And then we got a Venusaur EX, so the starter that we didn't want, unfortunately, we got in the EX form, which is still pretty cool nonetheless. Um, so hopefully this means we will pull a Blastoise or that Charizard right after, but maybe not, we'll see. Um, oh no, they did the gray thing on the sleeves again. Uh, like, it's kind of hard to, um, I can't put this in. It's kind of hard to see the card artwork without like pushing the sleeve back. And I don't know why they do that with the new sleeves, it's kind of annoying, but very cool, we got an EX card, so we cannot complain. Um, so that's, it took us four packs to get, to get an EX or better, or EX card at least. Um, so let's go ahead and maybe we'll also go for a full energy, um, full energy, hollow energy thing. That'd be nice. Uh, I don't know if the energy actually say the set number on them, but we'll see as we go along. So far we only have one, we have the steel energy. Uh, wait, I guess this is a basic energy. So yeah, we have this in hollow form. So it's a basic energy and is SVE. I don't know what that means. I don't think that's the set because this is Mew. This is the one, one if you want to it's Mew. Okay. Yeah, so it doesn't matter. It's not set specific, but I guess we'll still try to collect any, all of them anyway. So we have a Graveler, Arcanine. Uh, we have a Horsey, a Voltorb, and then a Machamp Hollow. Very, very, very cool. I love that artwork. That's an awesome artwork. All right. Um, yeah, I'm still like kind of in shock with the 151 revelation like I just had. That holy crap that there's 150, each mon gets their own artwork. That's insane. And they're listed in order. That's insane. So is this Venusaur? Is number three. Yeah, so this Venusaur is actually number three. That's insane. Sorry, that's like actually like really clever to me. Um, like if you don't know from my live streams, I like to kind of collect all the Pokemon in order. And... This is just the icing on the cake, because now it's in the TCG format. So that's awesome. Now we have leftovers, a Persian, we have a Muck, a reverse of a coughing, a reverse of a Bills transfer, and then we got an Electrode Hollow. All right. So we're still, I think we're one for six. I think we have three packs left. Uh, yeah, we have three packs left. So this is the seventh pack. And Hopefully we can kind of steamroll the, these last three packs uh, because I don't want this to be a drag on any longer. I made a drag on way too long with the whole epiphany stuff we just had. Uh, oh, another basic hollow energy. Oh, wow. And it looks like there's a swirl on this one. Is there a swirl on this one? The swirls are different. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, so we'll save that for a sleeve later too. We have a Nidoran, uh, Paris, Voltorb, Krabby, Parasect. Oyster, Giovanni's Charisma, 
Hoister Reverse, Cubone Reverse, nice. And then we got the Golem EX. Very, very awesome. Another EX Mon to add to our collection. So again, Golem is number 76 in the Pokédex, so that makes sense. It is 76 in the set, as you can tell from the bottom. Very, very, very nice. It seems like it is a double rare, like the other one was. So it looks like the two stars mean double rare. One star means regular rare. If it's a uh, two star with two gold stars, I think that's an illustrator rare, I think. Anyways, second to last pack. And we are doing pretty darn well so far. And let's see what we're gonna start with. All right, no, so no hollow energy there, but we got a regular energy. Porygon, Electabuzz, Coughing, Tangela, Daisy's Help, uh, Venomoth, Rapidash, a reverse hollow of a Dugong. Reverse Hall of Spear, I really thought this was an Illustrator art for a second, or one of those secret rares. Uh, and then we got a Marowak that actually looked really glossy and really cool. So we did get a Hollow of a Marowak. So, wow, we've completed quite a bit of cards. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of them are in Reverse Hall format, so I don't know if, I, if I'm going to go for a Master set. Do I want to collect... I, I mean, I have to collect the Reverse Hall and the regular one, so that's just the way it's going to be. Anyways, this is the last pack of the video. Can we pull a Squirtle, Blastoise, War Turtle artwork? Um, or even a Gold card or some, some secret rare, that'd be nice. Since this is the last pack, I always try to get out the code card in the last pack. And then we are going to see what we got. So we have an Energy, Sandshrew, Seal, Doduo, Tentacool, Rhydon, Rigid Band, uh, Nia Reno. Oh, wait, interesting. So our first reverse slot is a reverse rare. Oh, cause, uh, yeah, I guess reverses can be rare. All right, so we got a reverse of Mr. Mine, which is funny because he's upside down. Then we got a oh, nice, a ver another reverse rare of a Gyarados, so two reverse rares. And then we got the Mewtwo, the 150 Mewtwo. We're definitely gonna sleeve that up just now. Awesome, okay, so he's actually just a regular rare, um, which makes sense because he's just a hollow. Uh, you'd think that it would make him the EX, like a double rare or not. But you know, we got a lot of hollows from this. This is pretty good. I, I, every, every pack is guaranteed a hollow. So it's not like you're never gonna get a hollow. Um, but the fact that we got hollows that we really liked and we got a couple EXs is pretty awesome. So we got the two energies, which I still need to sleeve up. The Mewtwo artwork, a bunch of hollows. I'm just gonna quickly go through them. Machamp is one of my favorite ones there, besides that Mewtwo, Kabutops also. That new kid looks awesome too. And then we got the Golem EX and the Venusaur EX. So we got pretty good pulls, not the ones that we were looking for, but pretty good pulls overall. So I'm excited to open up more of these. And of course we got the awesome promo. So if you guys like this video, leave a comment, like, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram for a chance to win some code cards. I'll try to drop some sometime this week. And then I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.